Hello everyone. In this video, I will show some question related about tangents and normal and so how to solve this. So the first question is written in the screen and the question is if tangents are drawn from the origin, note given the origin to the curve y equal to sin x then so that the locus of the points of contact is x square y square is equals to x square minus y square. So the answer is like this given here y is equals to sin x is our curve and we have to find the tangent from the origin. So to find the tangent we have to find the slope of the tangent that is dy by dx and derivative of sin x is cos x. So as you don't know about which point let any point any point be on the curve on curve each hk hk so clearly the slope the slope at hk will be this is the dy by dx that is slope at any point from the cos x so the slope at hk will be cos h i just replace x h h so now the equation of tangent equation of tangent will be as you all know the formula y minus y1 is equals to dy by dx that is slope at that point x1 y1 into x minus x1 so as you take in y1 and x1 is the point h and k so i just put y minus y1 that is your k dy by dx is slope at this point and the slope at this point is cos h with x minus x1 that is your h now this is your equation of tangent line now in the question given that the tangent is from the origin so that means origin from the tangent tangent passes through the origin through origin that is 0 0 so clearly 0 0 point must satisfy this equation so I just put in place of y 0 and in place of x also 0 so we get minus k is equals to cos h 0 minus h will be minus h now I can see in both side there is a minus sign so we cancel this minus sign so this will be cos h cos h now we can simplify this and hence get this will be your h root over of 1 minus sin square h as you all know the formula of cos h will be written as in this form root over of 1 minus sin square h now we just left this now as the point hk as the point hk we come to this equation later now as the point hk is on the curve on the curve y equals to sin x as we have taken the point hk is on y equal to sin x that means this point must satisfy this equation so we can write at point hk the curve has a value k is equals to sin h now we get the value of sin h h k so we can put sin h k in this equation so i just put it that is your k is equals to h 1 minus sin square h so in place of sin square h i just write 
k square because k equal to sin h so k square now squaring both side squaring both side just write bracket and squaring both side we get this is your k square h square 1 minus k square simplifying further we get k square is equals to h square minus h square into k square that is h square into k square so taking minus a square k square to the left side h square k square and k square to the right side it will be like this h square minus k square now you can see that if we have taken the point hk we have taken the point hk but there is no point is given so that may be any point so if any point xy on the curve y equals to sin x then clearly this equation be your x square y square equals to x square minus y square which is our required proof so the number is already proved you all understand so this type of question occur in your exam so practice this and you can achieve the result.